Alright. I don't know how easy it is to add new mods into this sort of pre you know modded version of Minecraft, which is this ticket lift off series. Um because there's there are a couple that I've I've stumbled upon that I would like to have uh included, you know, in myself. Like like I did mention uh one of the last episodes, I mentioned the the one where you can walk around holding a torch and it lights up the area. I think that's pretty nifty. And I would definitely like to get some of that action going in here. Um as well as the one that shows the the mob uh, up in the top uh the top left it shows a sort of uh, health counter for when you're fighting mobs and such. Do we want? Yeah, why not? For now, at least we can always we can always change it. That's the beautiful thing about Minecraft. If you're not happy with something, just change it. So yes, this house will be sort of a work in progress. We will build it as we build it, and if we choose to change anything, uh, well, yeah, we we will do that. Uh, we will use normal wood to lay out the foundation here and uh, yeah some of the other buildings I plan on, on constructing is a so there'll be a, a sort of forge area uh, placed with with furnaces and where all the metal work and uh, and lots of crafting and stuff will be done there <coughs> I want to have a, a sort of storage warehouse uh, which will be linked into our quarry when we do get that up one day and that will that will sort of everything that we pipe in will go there okay and um and get sorted like <clears throat> there'll be like a sorting facility and all that included so we'll have everything automatically put into chests um uh, for us so we just know where everything is and that will make our life a whole lot easier uh as I did mention, ooh, look, we've got a, a, a tall, skinny guy over there. Hope he doesn't come steal any blocks of my house. Um, I also want something magical, like a magical castle or something type place <coughs> where I can experiment with the dimensional doors. And uh, I don't know, I don't think Thorncraft is in here. Um, I haven't seen any hints of it, at least, uh, such as the these what's it's uh liquid uh quicksilver trees I think um so the nodes and, and whatnot. I can't remember seeing it in the list. Did I miss a I think I missed a spot. It's gotta be thorough, you know, gotta be thorough. Oh yeah, gosh, I've missed a lot. Um where's my wood? Where's my wood? That's better. Want proper solid foundations, you know. You you don't want to build on shitty foundations. You know what they say: the wise man built his house upon the rock. Well, we built. Whoa, 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 my man! Piss off, go away, you little piece of shit face, little. Mm -hmm. Coming in. Well, I'm not. I'm not disturbing you. I'm just quietly working away on my own house, and you have the audacity, the audacity, to come into my house. Uh, that's not that's not a good plan. Actually, I have to remove this mud anyway, so that's fine. Uh, oh, we're out of we're out of jolly good wood. We need. Oh yes, <clears throat> that reminds me. You may see things jumping at me from a far distance, like those eggs just did. I have uh, switched on the magnet up here, so so items that are floating around on the ground uh, do just sort of jump at me. Uh, which makes, <coughs> excuse me, a bit of a frog in the throat. Which makes resource gathering sort of much easier, uh, especially like you, you chop down a big ass tree, and it comes crashing to the ground. Look at this! Look at this guy. Who do you think you are? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, yeah, then everything just hops straight into your inventory, and uh, you don't have to worry about running around. And oh, okay, this is where the party gets started. Come out here. If you, if you dare destroy, don't you dare blow up. Don't you dare. Thank you. I thought I heard a second one. Look at the stars. Isn't that beautiful? 
Oh, can you imagine with some shaders on? I wish. I wish I could get shaders on. It'd be so. It'd be gorgeous out here. Oh well, that was a seriously failed effort. You don't even want to know how much I was swearing, and I wanted to throw my PC straight out the window uh, with that fighting and just. Oh. <sighs> I went through I don't know however many tutorials and videos and this link and that link and this version and this this it, uh, it was a it was a nightmare an absolute bloody nightmare mm, let's take out this back wall and plunk down over here this is this is quite big, but <clears throat> once we've got a roof on our heads, it will it will take shape. I mean, <clears throat> like, <clears throat> uh, hang on a second. <coughs> <coughs> oh, good golly! <clears throat> uh, I don't know what's up. Let me have a drink of my coffee. Get whatever that is down. Oh, all right. Hmm. Bit of frogs. A bit of French in the throat. Um, I don't even. Where was I? I've, I've been completely distracted by that now. Uh, oh yes, this house will take shape as it takes shape. You know. So. So yeah, these rooms down here will probably be empty for quite a while. At least we'll have the the sort of shape in place. And this. Is a walled off area, is it? Yes. Yes? No. No, this is the archway the archway will go here. That's right. The archway will go here. This is walled off. And the stairs will go up here. Alright. Okay. So if this if you find this boring <clears throat> watching me just sort of run around here just plonking down bits of wood and and slowly building up something tough cookie this is what it is for now obviously when you know things things will progress and as things get made it will it will start making a lot more sense uh, another rude dude come to tango I'm a, but I'm, a, I'm a better dancer. I'm a better dancer than he is. Uh, and let's block that. Okay, we should have our front door in the middle. So we'll take that out. Yes. And plonk that down. Alright. I think that's not too shabby. The sun is rising. We've worked hard all night long. I would say it's time for a kip, but alas, can't sleep during the day. Which I find be a, a dreadful shame. I mean, I love taking an afternoon nap. These guys are still around. They're still hostile. Come here, you little piece of. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Oh, there's a there's a a blue dude over there. Come here. Has he seen us? He hasn't seen us. The zombies on fire. I don't know if that guy will. He's not just gonna leave in his own time. Oh, look at him. He's got a very strange texture, doesn't he? He always looks like a tire, like a tire road over him, squish, and left the, the tread embedded in his skin. Shame, poor fella. Whew, this is going to take a lot of wood, actually. I'm going to have to go do some harvesting. Ah, oh, yes. Let me just continue my little tour. So, the waterfall. The waterfall is going to come down from there, down there, and then it's going to flow down this corner here, and down into the into the river over there. This down here is I think a wonderful area to have a sort of farm sort of area where we can grow our wheat and our, our sugar cane and our, our whatever else as well as uh, plant a couple trees which I should probably do also getting a tad peckish um, there we go um, so we should plant a couple trees down here just to get some tree growth going because the, the trees are miles away. I mean we have to travel freaking meters <laughs> to get to the, the tree section. Let's just tidy this up. I'm quite OCD when it comes to sort of order and stuff. You, you might notice 
at, at, at times like this. I, I mean, this just irritates the life out of me. There we go. Much better. It should technically run all the way along here because this is here, but uh, that's for another day. Uh, let's see. We, we're cooking up nothing. I think we've, we've smelted everything we, we needed to smelt from our mining expedition. Obviously, all that stuff is, is locked away in these chests. Let's, but we're going to get out some of these as well as let's take some bones for some quick growth. Oh, chunks of wood. We may as well take that up to the chest upstairs. Put a piece of wood here. More wood we can take upstairs. Uh. We'll leave those saplings in there for now. We've got some bone meal, we'll take that along. And that looks that looks good. Alright. That looks good. Let's go drop off some of this newly acquired wood. And then go plant some trees. Oh crap, we got a ton of saplings in here. I didn't know that. Okay, let's just take uh put this all Oh we want to keep some of this. Um just want to clean out some of this crap from my inventory. Okay, let's uh, let's turn this these nine bones into bone meal. Fantastic, and let's go plant some trees. Oh, hang on, <laughs> I just put all my my saplings away. Okay, rubber saplings. Oh, great, I picked up some, so we will be able to grow some rubber trees. But for for now, for building purposes, we're going to need these uh these oaks because uh, they they're the wood we're using. Solid, good solid building, uh, ouch, um, trees. Uh, let's, let's start over here, yeah, okay. So we'll start, we'll plunk down a couple of trees here. Alright, this is going to look good, this is going to look very good. And we want a bit of bone meal to grow these suckers up. Yes, no. Oh, hello, there's one. Uh it's like a bit of RNG here with the the growing. I think when you do this and you see these little sparkly bits, you fed them. Oops, whoops, just click. Um and so if you multiple if you do them multiple times you can force them to grow like that. But I mean it can be quite expensive as far as you know burn meal goes. Uh so we may just oh that's a nice that's a nice one. We may just leave some of them to grow naturally. Uh, okay. All right, there's another one. All right, let's let's let's. No, we let, we'll leave them for now. We don't need to harvest them right away. When we come back, there may be some more. Um, we may as well just plonk down some randomly along the way because they're all going to be they're all going to be dug up anyway. So why the hell not? Maybe give us some shade from the, the sun. There we go. All right, that should grow into a nice little forest at some point. But for now, we just want to crack on with our walls, get the basic structure up. Uh, I will. Oh, thank you, chicken. I'll probably get eggs. Eggs. I've got now eggs on the brain. Uh, I'll probably get. Uh, the windows in later after I've put the walls in. Um, yeah, so I'll just do full-on brown wall uh, sort of look. How high do we want this roof? We want this roof to be yeah, probably about the AI. Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll we'll go that high. So let's just climb up here, and we'll start plunking down some of this. At least get the roof on, if if, if anything. Okay, uh, that's fine. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's get we'll get these posts up first, I think. Me thinks. Ouch. Okay. All right. Good. 
Good, good. Whew. It's quite it's quite time consuming actually doing all this, but you know the reward afterwards when you've done it and you get to step back and and you know look upon your your amazing creation. It just fills it fills one with such a a warmth. I'm actually I'm actually feeling a bit of logs down here, quite honestly. Let's do it. We're gonna be thorough about this. Also the logs are stronger than the wood, so it's like it's added support. Speaking of support, we'll have to we'll have to consider. Obviously in Minecraft, you know, there's no such thing as as, as support for blocks. Uh because <laughs> Floating islands, hello. So it's all, but it's all about you know reali realism and stuff. If if it looks like we might need to have a pillar to hold something up in wherever we are, whatever building, that's what we shall have. Okay, so let's just get this across. The stairway we shall we shall leave unroofed for now. This little area here, because this is going to go up. And if I want a nice archway here, I'm probably going to have to move that up as well. But that's fine. That's fine. Oops. Uh, let's get rid of this. So yeah. That's that's it. I hope. How how are you guys doing? Uh, I I forgot to ask. You know, just throw me a comment if you had a good day, a good day, a, a good week, a, a good a good a good month. Has it been a good year in general for you guys? I don't know. Just let me know if you know what's happening. Oh no, what am I doing? No, no, that's fine. That's fine. Let's uh, we'll we'll stop that there. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So with the mods, I. Ha they are, like I said, there's a, there's a ton of them, and I will be looking at them in sort of segments, uh, getting my bearings, seeing what we have, what we can do, and uh, what we will do. Obviously, there is an end goal uh, in mind, and that end goal is to get to the moon. That's right, space travel out there somewhere. Uh, I think it's just the moon re uh, at the moment. Um, I'm not too sure if there are actually other planets. You can go to if if you can, uh, please do let me know. I'd be most interested, most curious to if, if you can travel to other planets. I don't even know how it works. I mean, are you supposed to like manually fly the craft? Uh, you know, I don't, I don't have a clue. Okay, that's fine. Um, I don't have a clue. I mean, we, we will get there at some point. So. It's going to be an exciting day, though, when we when we do get to the point where we can start actually thinking about going to space, building a, our our launch pad and our and our rockets and our. I, can we build a space station? Can we build a a place on the moon that we can call our our home away from home? I don't know. Yeah, it would be fun, though.